Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to share with you how we can easily make a pie chart on GeoGebra. You know that GeoGebra is an open source, free dynamic software which can be used for creating interactive applets. And it is a great tool for mathematics teachers and learners for exploring mathematics. So here, let us take the example. A box contains 24 marbles of different colors. The following table shows the number of marbles of these different colors. Draw a pie chart for the data. So you see that we have uh, made a table here, which has three columns. In the first column, color of marbles is taken. In the second column, number of marbles are listed. And then in the third column, we have calculated sector angle. Because you know that in a pie chart, it's a circle graph. So we must know the sector angle of each and every item which is taken up in the pie chart. So here, the red color is represented by sector angle of 150 degrees. So there are 24 marbles. So 10 upon 24 into 360 degrees. So we have calculated this sector angle. Now you will be amazed to see how colorful pie charts we can create in GeoGebra by just following simple steps. So do you want to learn how to make such colorful pie charts? So let us go through the applet. So here, this is uh, GeoGebra online version. I'm using this. And uh, let me demonstrate the steps for making a pie chart. So first thing is, we will be using circle tool. And first, we are going to take up a circle here. Now you can see this tool I have used. Circle with center through point. OK. And we have taken a circle with center A and a point B on the circle. After that, we will be making a sector. And here it is given that you, I'm coming back to the question. Here you see it is given that red color has the sector angle 150 degrees, right? So we will be making an angle of 150 degrees. How we do this? For doing so, we will be using this angle with given size tool. So angle with given size. You click on A and click on B and fill 150 degrees. And you get this point B dash on the circumference of the circle. And then Using the line segment tool, we can draw AB and AB dash. Now you see we have got one sector and this sector is representing the color A. Moving further, using the same tool, angle with the given size, in the anti-clockwise direction, we get point B dash, B double dash, and we see that after joining A, B double dash, we get another sector, B dash, A, B double dash, right? Then we get the third sector in the same way in the anti-clockwise direction by taking angle with given size that is 75 degrees. And then finally, we get the last remaining sector you know, that is the left one out of 360 degrees. So 45 degrees is left. We can write there as well. OK, now use this text tool for writing the information in the sectors, right? In the slices, you can say. So use this ABC text tool. And here we have depicted red color. In the anti-clockwise direction, then green, then yellow, and then blue. Okay. 
now we need to fill in the color in these sectors so how to do that go to this circle tool and please see this one circular sector so use this circular sector tool and first try to fill in the sector a b b dash a right and see how we have done this and go to the object properties of this sector and you can change the color so it is representing red color so i have taken the red color here similarly using this circular sector tool i'm just taking your attention to this tool i'm talking about this tool circular sector tool right so make the sector second sector and then after that fill the color by changing the object properties similarly go for the third one change you can change the color by changing the object properties and the last one see how easy it is to make a pie chart in geogebra now if you wish to make a worksheet you can use any snipping tool or save it as an image and use this image any where right so this is how we have used uh, the geogebra tool for uh, creating the pie chart i hope uh, you you will be using this in your math classroom for making teaching learning of mathematics interesting engaging and exciting for the learners thank you have a nice day bye bye take care